Oh, I look crazy. Hey, everybody. Hi, everyone. I haven't been on here in a while. What's happening, everybody? I'm let let it let it build up. Let me tag the person who needs to be on here since, you know, this is going to be about him. How's everybody been? Hi. Oh, I miss you guys. Literally, I have been, I've been working and uh, we, we just got a new judge that Melly's definitely about to be free. It's so this is now the third judge in his case. Will you marry me? You know what? I don't think I'm ever going to get married again. Like, I don't even think I'm ever going to date again. As y'all know, I recently was in a very like public relationship that is not ending very well because he's trying to do a lot of things, threatening to release a lot of uh, videos and different things about me. So I decided to come live and basically let everybody know what is possibly about to come out. So Kellen is not taking, he not taking the breakup very well. Hi, Kellen, you're on here. Good. I'm glad you joined. I'm glad you joined because I, I literally said, I'm not doing this with you that if you're going to release videos and things like that about me, I'm going to release them first. I remind you so much of Melly. Melly has my whole face. Yeah, I'm just, it's a rough day. It's a really rough day. And, you know, nobody, nobody deserves. Yes, you broke up with me, which is fine. All I'm saying is don't, don't do the extraness. I have no hard feelings towards anybody. No hard feeling toward anybody, you know. So, yeah. Why he on here arguing with me? I, I don't know. If I post some of the messages that he's been saying to me and the awful names he's been calling me, it's it's really bad. <laughs> You, I seen you with the tattoos of Melly. You, oh, me neither. No, but you just literally sent me that video over and over, telling me you're gonna release the videos of us in other videos. That is child to me. It's childish. It's very childish. But it is what it is. I got too much going. That's exactly why I stay single. This is why I don't get in relationships. This is why I stay single. I have a child that's fighting for his life. I have another one that I'm trying to manage to get take him to the next level. I have another artist that I'm managing. I have a show coming out very soon, guys. Executive produced by me, Boss Moms of Miami. Shout out to all my boss moms that's going to be on the cast. Um, so, you know, I did. I got caught up in this relationship thing. And I am literally the most easiest person to get along with. I really don't do anything. You guys know me. You guys watched me for years. I don't do drama. You never hear my name in drama. I've never been called such awful names in my life in any relationship that I've ever been in. You know, and I don't do toxic relationships like whatsoever. You know. I don't know. I don't I I don't I don't know. I I just I don't know. I really don't know. And it yeah, I'm cool. It Things happen. Look, it happens. It was a fun ride. I just don't like people doing, you know, things like that to me because I'm actually really a good person and I really love my kids and I have a lot to lose. I'm still a nurse. I still work as a nurse. I don't need people trying to damage my reputation and trying to damage my livelihood. And yeah, that does scare me. So yeah, I am scared of him because yeah, he does have videos and things that he's trying to threaten to release against me. And it sucks because I would never do anything like that to anyone to hurt somebody. So Melly, it, Melly and Boards go to court on July 8th. I am. I'm going to always be strong. I have no other choice but to be strong. Strong is all I know. It's just I never, I've never experienced anything like, I've never experienced anything like this before. Like ever. Like ever. So, no, I did. I contacted my lawyer. Um, 
We'll see. We'll see what happens. We still doesn't we still don't have an actual trial date yet. We don't we're waiting, you know. Um but yeah. I promise on everything, I don't think I'm ever getting in another relationship. You know, my kids had to see this like publicly and I mean, I really have a lot of love for Kellen. Really, really, really did. I mean, apparently, I mean, he played me the whole time. The whole time. But, hey, it happens. No, you, you're not going to threaten me. I, this is the thing. I own my bullshit. I'd rather own my bullshit and let it be known if some shit like what you're planning on releasing is going to come out about me. I will take the power and release it first. Period. You're not about to do that. That, that's what we're not gonna do i've done enough shit people know i've listen i've hit the blocks for several things i've done parties for my son at the jail i dropped the only fans even though i was doing nothing on my only fans like i own my stuff i do whatever i need to do i own my stuff and i truly did love you kelly and i didn't do anything but wish nothing but the best for you and you really like you really played in my face and then you tried me with little dirty little girls that is just crazy like i'm a grown woman you win but what you will not do is try to publicly embarrass me which ain't embarrassing because i look good so it is what it is like it is it really is what it is but it's just disrespectful because i have children and you're threatening to release tapes and things like that 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 that's why i said what i said and if i post the text messages of how you talk to me that's when you should be like really upset because lots of people love me. Yeah, you got a lot of people that follow you for your content, but nobody knows who you are. You have not made your way in, in this industry yet or over here. So that's just that. That's the most, he's being very childish about the breakup. Yes, he broke up with me and it's fine. He broke up with me over a birthday party that I went to with my friend. And he's done a lot of things anyway that I should have been broke up with him about. And, you know. But the disrespectful calling me names and threatening to release videos and stuff is just unheard of. Yeah. And I hate that I had to come live to even talk about that because anybody knows I'm very private. I've never posted being in a relationship before. I've never posted getting out of a relationship. I done been married, divorced, and y'all didn't even know. <laughs> y'all didn't even know. Like, I really don't do drama. I tried to explain I don't do drama. You made an OnlyFans, though. I did, and I paid a lot of lawyer fees with that money, and I got a new car. Exactly. And if you log on to my OnlyFans, you'll see what I do on there. Because people think OnlyFans is only for doing sex stuff. No. OnlyFans, I actually cook dinner on there. So, yeah, nothing on there is great. And I'm dressed, and I have clothes on. So, yeah, no, nothing I do will ever, like, be, like, to the point where it's disrespectful to my children. Because I love my children. I love you, slime. I love my children, but I'm not going to let a man try to destroy everything I worked so hard for and everything that I've built. YNW is a brand. We are a legacy and we are here to stay. And that's that. And that's that's on that. And that like so it is what it is. So anything that is leaked or came out, you guys know exactly who it came from. If it gets leaked or if it comes out. And, you know, I'll keep you guys updated on everything that's going on. And, you know, this is hard. Breakups are hard, but I've just never experienced this level of disrespect and this level of threats. And I know I'm a good woman and I know I'm not a whore and a groupie and all these awful names that this man chooses to call me. And it's very unfortunate because I... I really wanted him to be great. I really wanted to see him do something more with his, you know, with his following, with his content, which is great, you know, or whatever. But, you know, it's all going to work out. Hey, at the end of the day, I have to own my wrongs. I have to own my wrongs as well. So, 
Yeah. Yes, Melly is definitely coming out and we have a new judge and you know, a lot has been working in our favor and I'm going to continue to pray and keep God first and I'm not going to let a man try to destroy everything, you know. I'm not I'm not mad. I'm I mean, of course I'm a little sad, but I'm definitely I'm not mad like, you know, not at all. But you guys have a beautiful day. I am about to get my hair done because I look crazy right now. So I'm about to wash my hair and go on about my day. You know, it's been great. Everybody. Bye.